Hi people, what's going on? Good morning from Dhaka, Bangladesh. 12.30 here in Dhaka. I'm doing series of reviews. This is my third review today. I've covered two female perfumes, which are vintage uh, from back in that time, 80s, 90s. Uh, those are already uh, done. So third one I'm going to do, uh, perfume.ad, sorry, AE. I always say AD. AE. It's a joint collaboration between uh, one of our uh, like businesses here called Fragrantica Bangladesh and also I think Luxodor. I think they together are creating this line. They have hundreds of fragrances they usually do uh, inspired fragrances like uh, bring back discontinued niche upper class and some expensive perfumes they have a uh, lot of inspired inspired versions so you can say clones so <laughs> if you can make it simple and these fragrances are somewhere between 35 to 45 dollars not super cheap but uh, you know depending on what they're cloning so i reviewed three or four i'm not quite sure and i have bought I think I was gift, gifted one fragrance and I had some sample reviews. So this is part of my third or fourth, okay, from this house. So this is called, uh, I think, uh, what's the name of this? This is called, um, what's the name? And I always forget the name. Where is the name of the fragrance? Okay, it's called Pineapple Blizzard because it's confusing on the box. Does it say? Mm, nope. It says Hachivat, okay, basically on the box it will say Hachivat. So it's a clone of Hachivat. This is the packaging. And big thanks to brother Intaza Lazim for uh, bringing this to me. He said, brother, do you want to review this? Because I have this recently. I bought a partial. And I said, definitely I'll take it because uh, creating content is my hobby. Man, I sprayed on the box. It smells so good. Okay, it's a 100ml version. I think this one he paid uh, 35 bucks, perhaps. And this is the bottle. The box kind of looks like not very posh. I'll be honest with you. This looks like a tester box, but it's okay. They have a lot of writings. And they have two kind of bottles. Transparent bottle like this. They also have a colored painted bottles uh, colorful bottles so this one looks like that i like the name the name is pineapple blizzard interesting and our creation of nishan is hachivat and they say uh, where they make it uh, dubai uh, fragrantica bangladesh this is the joint collaboration you can see the names so you can say bangladesh and dubai joint collapse and you can order this on their page i'll leave a link below nice little cap wooden cap but doesn't have any magnet or a uh, snack fit okay so i would not try to pick it up by the cap atomizer is very good very good one of the best atomizer it's like dior savage but better okay so i already sprayed it. i know this fragrance i've been testing it i'll be returning it tomorrow so let's do quick review on this so you guys know hachiva is one very popular fragrance from nishane i did have vintage then i do have a new version as well hachiva basically people say it's a clone of aventus i never really feel like that it has a musky sort of like a lotiony a thick kind of presence with that pineapple accord and reminds me a lot of some of the other fragrance like pineapple vintage intense you know those sides little bit of uh, aventus but little bit also of afternoon supremacy not only intense sedenim but much higher quality these fragrances are super quality and super long lasting but now the prices have gone high it used to be like 50, 150 bucks you could get it before now the fragrance are more like 200 dollars plus so that comparison this one is i think 35 38 bucks i think it's uh it makes sense but then again they do have many clones of hachivat how good is this so i did tell you uh, some of the creation of this house i felt it was not really up to the mark i mean i found some of them to be a bit weak they did not last that much some of them didn't copy so well um maybe i haven't tried everything so this one is good the Hachivat is very good longevity especially first of all strong point longevity is very very good um, I think this one will carry on on the clothes okay if you spray heavily like double double shots double double you know here sorry did I just hit the mic <laughs> if you go like seven eight ten sprays this will last you about seven to eight hours so that is not bad at all so the EDB concentration true in this second thing the smell the smell is like Hachivat but is a little bit more lemony and does not have that powdery or lotiony that creamy effect that Hachivat gives me. Hachivat is very musky on the dry down, and that's the one that carries the fragrance through. Hachivat, the older batches, lasted well over 20 hours on my clothes. Okay. Uh, this one, not bad at all, but it's more citrusy, more lemony version. You can say, you can smell uh, Club New Intense Man, the limited edition perfume or the ADP. This one, it's kind of similar to those, okay, but better quality. Also reminds me of Sedrat Boise, but Sedrat Boise is a lot more juicy. For the price, not bad. Smell, not bad. It's very, very good. So I think this is the best so far I tried from their house. And I think in the summer days, you can use it for work, office, gym, 
anywhere you go it could be your signature scent just go heavy on the spray do not go like one to two sprays then it will not last overall my uh, assessment on this one i'll give it like 8.5 out of 10 um just because it's it smells good and projection and longevity is decent but the price i think would be they can uh, negotiate and do it like 32 dollars maybe 30 dollars this would be a very very good buy thanks for watching thank you intezer bhai for your bottle loan i'll just move into the last episode then we'll upload this thanks for watching guys and try it out i'll leave a link below where you can find these take care bye bye